um, one of the things that excited me the most with through and with sonic enhancement is the low frequencies, which are really prominently generated through the bass guitar or the kick drum. And um, to me, that is the root and the foundation of all music or most music. Yeah. And uh, to have that as a, as a primary ingredient in the process or, uh, you know, vital to what you're drinking at the end of the day is really cool for me as a bass player right. and as a fan of the rhythm section. When we do, you know, the sonic treatment uh, to, uh, to the, the barrels, basically what we're doing is we're pushing forms through, 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 through fluid. Right. Because every frequency has a different form. If you get a vibrating plate and you put, put sand on the vibrating plate and you take different frequencies, you take, you know, like, you know, 130 hertz, and you vibrate it on the plate, the sand causes a design. Right. You know, you take it up to 10K, completely different Changes design. It. You know, you take it to 400K, completely different design. So what I realized is, is that our music, you know, has all these different frequencies. It has all these different forms. Each, each song has a different set of forms. Right. That it's right. pushing through the music, uh, through, the, through the whiskey. Right. And I'm thinking that that right there is a cool thing, pushing forms through the whiskey. Already. It's literally embodying it. Yeah. Right? It's, it's almost like magic. And that, yeah. how cool is that? It's it's pretty uh, it's pretty impressive. I mean, when you think about it, and that's and that's well said because I've seen that before where they do the sand yeah. on on the drum head and it's a it's a, a a living embodiment of that that you can take to the next level experientially. Right. You know, right. it's a a different way to experience all that kind of stuff. And I, I think that's why the playlists are always so fascinating for people. You know, like we have the different playlists. You guys have selected songs. The one thing that I remember. Um, that I thought was important when I got to select some songs for the Batch 100 uh, Black and Special Release um, was that some of those some of those songs I selected were live, um, and they were they were they were live recordings, and that that live recording um, was the voices of the of the fans, and that was also a part of it. So you oh, know, cool. they, so they're adding to it. So the fan base is adding to um, the elements that the music is adding to. So now it's 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 all the same, you know, in the liquid. I love it. Good. Good. Come on, we're back in. 